The county library, like a lot of other locations, closed right now because of COVID-19. Jeff Bido is here to talk to me from the county library. And as you can see, a little extra space. Yeah. We're following social distancing guidelines here in the station. So, Jeff, thank you so much for coming in. We appreciate it. Yeah, thanks so much for having us. How is the county library responding to this pandemic? Um, well, we're doing a couple of different things. Um, first of all, the, the libraries are obviously a place where they try to educate people. Mm -hmm. And we are really doing that in two ways. Um, first off, we're trying to provide um, unbiased information directly from the source. So if you're following like our social media pages, um, you'll see that all of our posts about COVID-19 come from, um, you know, government sources or straight from wherever the information is generated. Um, and secondly, we are providing people with a lot of ways to educate themselves while they are either not working or stuck at home with kids or whatever's going on. Yeah, we've all life. got a lot, lo lot yeah. more free time yeah, than we for anticipated sure, for having. Sure. Yeah, and we have point. things we have things to do uh, that you can do in that free time. So okay, so good. Talk to me about some of those resources. How do you can sure. you still access like movies and books from the library? Yeah, absolutely. So um, we always say we're more than books, and we are more than books. Um, our online resources are are extensive. Um, we have, um, you know, learning resources like lynda.com where you can go online and you can learn all about, uh, you know, photography or small business. Cool, or so you can CAD. take a class. Yeah, basically. And you can take a full career path on these websites. Awesome. Um, also, we have a thing called Creative Bug where you can come and um, learn crafting, um, learn how to mm -hmm. crochet, how to sew, those kind of things. Um, and we have kids zone activities um, and all kinds of great things. Love it. I think that's, I mean, a lot of parents uh, didn't anticipate having their elementary yeah. school kids or high school kids yeah. like home with them during yeah. the day right now. So awesome resource. Yeah. I saw you guys are also doing uh, your Facebook lives every day. You're doing yeah. like a story time every yeah. day. Yeah. So we've decided since we typically have a story time at 1030 every uh -huh. day, we're going to do a Facebook live um, story time. I love that you're doing yeah. this. Yeah. It's really cool. And so I think we're going to do that at different branches every single day. Uh -huh. So we just watch our Facebook live and those will be popping up. We have some other Facebook live ideas that we're kind of tossing around too to help get information out as well. Okay. Um, but like it's moving so fast, as you know, um, we're not sure exactly what we're going to do with that yet, but You're definitely adapting. story time every like day at 1030. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Yeah. So I will admit to, to you and to the audience, I have a book that's overdue yeah. from my <laughs> local library and I've been hesitant to, to like drop it off because I'm sure. a little worried about, you know what I mean? What the, what the restrictions sure. are. So what, what's the guideline for us readers out there? What would you like us to do with our books? Can we check out books? Um, yeah, well, you can still check out, um, eBooks and you can do that on our website and that's free with your County library card and you can do e audio books as well. However, you can't check out out hard books. Okay. So um, regular books are a no-go and we're not taking returns on them anymore either. Um, that stopped yesterday. Okay. So, but you won't be fined either during the temporary closure. Got it. So we'll wait out this period, yeah. wait for information from you guys. Exactly. Perfect. Okay. Where should people go for all this information? Uh, Thecountylibrary.org. All right. You're seeing it right there on your screen. Tons of resources for you while you're at home. Voluntary quarantining. Jeff, thanks so much for coming in. Again, thanks for having us. Appreciate it. Brian?